top of the evening. We got Jake Paul versus Tommy Fury fighting for a belt. They have an actual WBC belt that they made for this fight. Um, so this will probably put one of these guys, Tommy Fury or Jake Paul, in the top uh, maybe 25 ranking system in the WBC, I'm assuming. Um, so it probably won't be no higher, but Tommy Fury and Jake Paul had a press conference and boy was it fire. Tommy Fury has to win this fight. Um, the boxing, boxing pundits are expecting him to win this fight. If not, Jake Paul has bridged the gap between boxing and YouTubers. You see that bridge, the Saudi Arabian bridge right there. Jake Paul, if he beats Tommy Fury, which all the pundits, well some of the pundits, I'm not going to say them all, have Tommy Fury beaten Jake Paul. But if Jake Paul wins, he basically has crossed over and bridged the gap between YouTubers and boxers, professional boxers. Ain't that something? Jake Paul seems like he's the one with the more experience when he talks to Tommy Fury. Tom, Tommy Fury comes from a long lineage of gypsy super boxers. The dad was a boxer. And of course, everybody knows Tyson Fury, the gypsy king, is the best boxer at heavyweight division presently, besides Alexander Usyk. This fight is going global, and it will be on ESPN Plus tomorrow night, or tomorrow morning, rather. I just know I got ESPN Plus. I'm about to turn it on now, and I'm so excited. And, and I'm only going for the boxer, so I'm going to go for Tommy Fury, but anything's possible. Let's get it, true media world. And I'm out. Peace. One, I'm a wolf.